this is the bolus that Neo puked up yesterday morning. Some of you may have seen. The day before, I uh, puked up uh, one piece of white plastic. And then yesterday, you might have heard squealing sounds, almost sounded like a kitten. And uh, that was the sound of Neow puking up uh, indigestibles. Albatross are pre-programmed to uh, get rid of things they can't digest. In this case, mostly squid beaks. They sort of look like those old corners we used to use in, photogra in photographic albums, those little black corners. Small, um, little pointy tip, very sharp. It's, what, it's the business end of the squid. Thank you, the rooster really likes that. And it's the one part of the squid that the albatross can't digest. So they save them up, and then they puke them out. What happened was that Niao got lots of squid beaks from Ko'olau, the dad, and Malu Malu, the mom, and also, incidentally, got these little pieces of plastic. This is actually a very, very healthy bolus. We've seen ones that are, uh, that are as much as half plastic. So this has got lots of good uh, squid beaks in it. Janine is going to count all those squid beaks. But take a guess at how many squid it appears that our beloved Niao has had since baby time. This may not be the last bolus we see. There may be another um, before she fledges. <coughs> I'm just saying she because I don't want to say it. Uh, we should find out this week what gender um, all four chicks on this property are this week or next week. Um, Janine, you weighed that too, didn't you, yesterday? Mm -hmm. What was the weight? Do you remember? Uh, 2.3 ounces. I'm not sure about the grams. Okay. It's 50 something. Two, yeah, okay. 2.3 ounces. We didn't convert it to grams, so. Can you identify any of those pieces of plastic, Janine? Can you tell what any of them are from? miscellaneous little scraps, huh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. These parents seem to be attracted to white plastic. Sometimes there are parents that have more blue or red or orange in them. Could be coincidence. Ah, there's a piece of thread or fishing line. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks like fishing line, huh? We've seen, we've seen uh, birds puke up uh, things as large as a toothbrush. Um, commonly are bottle caps. And if anything ever convinces you more to go off of plastic water bottles, it's that. You see lots and lots and lots of floating bottle caps. Okay, so it looks like in there, there are probably hundreds of beaks. Hard to say for sure, but you can see it's a really good quantity. For those of you who are watching yesterday after Niao puked that up, there seemed to be a rather uh, burst of energy. Um, lost a bunch of stuff that had been in the upper stomach. Albatross actually have a, a proventriculus, a pre-stomach, where um, the the food can be saved. It gets, for in the parents, they can distill it down to oil. So the solid matter goes down to the lower stomach and the oil stays upper and is what they puke to the, to the chick at first. And then the older they get, the more solid matter they get. So if you saw some of those photos that we posted this morning, um, Niao got everything from Ko'ola yesterday, from s big, solid chunks of either fish or squid, um, all the way down to oil, just high-octane oil. What was it somebody put, la put up recently that squid oil uh, is equivalent in caloric and octane level to, uh, let's see, a quart, I think, is equal to something like 25 Ben and Jerry ice cream bars, something like that. Very high caloric. You've seen how fast our dear Niao has grown. So little pieces of rock, um, very lightweight, almost like a limestone. <laughs> Look like the side of the size of a seed pit, but they really are rocks, I think. There's very little odor to it um, for people who think this is disgusting. It actually smells a little bit, just a little fishy. Um, if we left it confined in a Ziploc bag for a long time, it would develop a smell. But it's really not bad. 55 grams is that particular, came out in two parts, two, two boluses.
Okay, everybody, I hope that's been educational and fun to see. Thanks so much, everybody. Bye.